Wait. That's not right. Oh, there it is. Hey, what's up? It's not my birthday anymore, but thank you. Close enough. It's me, Mario. Hello. No, nah, I didn't set up the compressor. Hey, I was wondering. If I want donation sounds to come from something that's not my headset, but if I were to play a PC game, I could still hear it coming through my headset. Uh, maybe what I'll do is just change on my desktop audio to just like my crappy monitor audio so I can hear it, but it won't be like too loud. I'll think about it. You're so old now. I was already old. <laughs> Since the last time you see me, I'm only two days older. I don't understand. Oh, it must not be two coins. It must be the, the last coin. Yeah, it's, this'll fail. what I get for my birthday? I got a hoodie. I got a picture of a mini fridge. I'm supposed to find out if it's the one I want. I also made some offhand, okay, so like when I was opening, so I got a new board game for Christmas called uh, Nemesis. It's like some weird alien board game for dorks. And it had these little decks of cards that I had to open and I couldn't open it. Like it's basically like the plastic was so close to the cards and my scissors were so big that like I couldn't cut the little thing. So I was just like, so I made a comment. I was like, damn, make sure next year I get the tiniest pair of scissors that exist, like scissors that are like this big. So they got me scissors that are like this big. And I was like, gee, thanks. I can finally open my board game plastic. And they were like, that's what you want it for? It's kind of a... They were like disappointed after I told them what I actually was going to use it for. Yeah, they're not, I'm not disappointed I got it. Do you guys have mini fridges that are like actually silent? Like if I put it in my room, it wouldn't, you wouldn't hear it in the background. You guys know any mini fridges like that? That aren't sponsored by like G Fuel or whatever, so I don't have to pay extra money. You're so sick at texture setup. 
here's the issue with texture setup. You were noticing... Oh, wait, whoops. You were noticing I was getting, like, 12-7, 12-5. And I fail it, like... See, like, this will be 14. So I'm losing, like, a 1.75 seconds, let's say. But typically, if I'm doing that correctly, I get it every time. When I'm doing 120 star, I'm just like, fuck it, dude. I don't even care. Like, I'm just gonna do this, get the run going. I don't wanna have to reset it once endlessly in 120 star. But it's funny because I'm starting to fail this shit now. So there's less of a reason to do it. Like, if I'm failing it the safe way, I might as well just start doing that. I still, uh, not a big fan. My birthday technically passed, but it's fine. It's close enough. The annoying thing with texture setup is, like, I don't even, like, totally understand. It's basically, like, whenever you... Like, if you start pressing the C buttons a little bit early, then all of a sudden the texture is in a different spot. Like, a lot of the time I'm not even really using the texture, I'm just using how close I am to the coin. This will probably fail, but whatever. I don't get this trick. It's not worth me practicing right now. <sighs> You're happy to watch anything that's not Lethal Lava Land? Why do you dislike Lethal Lava Land all of a sudden? Hey, if I'm doing 16 star, what's the fastest route I can do that's not LBLJ? What trick is he doing? Mega. How'd your smash tourney go? It just begun? You mean like you're in it? You're doing it right now, or are you supposed to be sleeping or something? Safe state up there. I watched you play a little bit of that baseball game. Your first run was like insanely good. 
Mostly because Piney wasn't throwing you any heat, dude. Piney can sometimes throw some nasty shit. But overall, I would say that you're... You probably have a better chance of beating it quicker than I did. I was mostly impressed. If you... Do you want any tips? Actually, I won't give you any tips. You don't need them. The nice thing is if I give you a tip, then I can say that you want it because of me. Okay, I'm gonna tell you some tips. First, I think the third boss and the fourth boss are easier than the first and the second. So you get past the first and the second, and you're, you're set. You should be able to do it. The fifth guy, he doesn't fuck around though. The, the fifth guy does not fuck around. So it's pretty much like when you get past Piney, it's just like, all right, we're chilling until we get to the fifth guy. Outside of that, I won't give you any tips. He didn't really struggle on Harry though. Like the thing was he got to Harry and like the first time you get there, it's gonna take you like a look, you know, like a couple hits to get used to it. And if you just barely get past Piney, you're probably fucked. But he did that on like his first run. So to barely get past Piney in your first run is still really good. Am I middle-aged when I hit 40, or is it 30? After the two long jumps on the top second, keep holding Z and do an instant jump dive. I always try to do that and it fails, but I think the reason why it fails is because I'm not holding Z. So that might bring it over the top. even quicker. <laughs> okay. It's easy enough to avoid. It's not quite as easy as I thought to avoid, but... Hey, when I get here... Should I be long jumping? Or should I be... Diving? I feel like diving's gotta be better. When you say yes, I don't know what you're referring to. Whichever's fastest. Yeah, but see, that's why I'm asking you. Long jump's better? Alright.
I'd like to make it so I don't have to wall jump. That's the goal. I'll do it one more time. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Wow, dude, I saved it? I didn't even know you could save it. I'm gonna just do a couple runs today and then um, probably swap to something else. It's me, they just keep doing the same level over and over. I mean, he's right. Does it say virgin? No. He was watching me do this same level over and over again. Plans to do 120 again? Yeah. I care about 120 the most. I drink a ton of cranberry juice. This thing was horrible. <laughs> Thanks for said wiser. Wait, does cranberry juice help you pass drug tests? I'm worried the cranberry juice gave me a kidney stone, but then I Googled it, and apparently cranberry juice is good for kidney stones, so I don't understand. Good for, as in, good at stopping them. That poppy seed failed drug test is in like so many sitcoms. It's in Seinfeld. And it's in something else too that I forget. Here we go. It's in something else too. And maybe it's a movie. Hey, okay, thanks, nuts. I'll do it in 16 star. Dylan, it's not even hard to do. The difference is that in 120, it's not worth the risk. <laughs> but in 16, it definitely is.
Another thing too is um the old setup that I use, the sock folder setup. Ever since coming back, I'm not like really, really consistent with it, so it's like what the fuck's the point? Like if I can't hit it like a hundred percent of the time, I might as well go for texture setup, which I get like seventy-five percent of the time. No, that was weird. How do you still look 20? I don't know. Wait, I'm not supposed to do the star. Shit. We should just do it now. This could be fast. Not bad. Dylan, you got 12.4 one time. Also, I just golded your womps in like one try. You can't make fun of me. <laughs> More than once? I don't believe you. I guess I'll just fucking go. <laughs> Whatever. Probably should get the other star, but I don't feel like it. Thanks, Gorbo. Any updates on merch? No. If I do stream a lot this year, I'll do merch. But the odds of that happening are very low. Fuck. Yeah, I probably would make Ludwig do all the merch work. Hi, Forson. <laughs> I 
No. No. <laughs> Do you think it's weird that people watch you after you vanish for so long? I used to think it was more weird. But... Now, I don't as much anymore. The way that I... Like... I don't know, I don't think taking breaks hurts some streamers as much as you would think, because it's like, I don't know, maybe people get bored of watching the same guy all the time. But if you just show up every once in a while, people don't get as bored of you as quickly. Shit, I could have golded that. I don't know. It's like Asmongold takes a lot of breaks and he can come back and be fine. There's probably a lot of other streamers that can do it. No, he can't. I thought he could. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he can. Wait, I'm not supposed to do this one. Style of points. Probably like, like, like think about it. There's some streamers that get like banned for like a month and then they come back and they're more popular. I mean, being banned is just like a forced vacation. They could simulate the same thing by just... Take a break. But yeah, I don't know. It probably does hurt me on some level. The way that I figure it is like, if I take a really long break and a lot of people left, and I can't get them back after a while from streaming, it's like, oh shit. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? This is the easy part, Mario. Gotta earn them back. Heard them back so you can leave them again? I said earn, not heard, but... Thanks for 500 bits, dark blue name I can't read. You guys make it sound much more toxic than it actually is. Of course. <laughs> I 
Okay. That was kind of weird. And I fucked up. Alright, I'll do another one. Practice this for 20 minutes. That's not that long, but that does seem to happen a lot, where it's like the one thing that I practice is the one thing that I fuck up. Yeah, I know. Nice ton of. I know it hurts to like from a from like farming viewers perspective, it does hurt to like take breaks all the time. But I'm pretty fine with the amount of viewers that turn in and like or tune in, whatever the fuck. I wanted to say tune, but turn I guess kind of works too. Pretty satisfied. I don't have any illusions or like want to be like the biggest streamer ever. I just cut out a chunk. Live with my chunk. You guys are a chunk. I think the most fun I ever had streaming was either right when I started. I can't tell if it was because it was just new to me or if it was because I liked the like 20 or 30 viewers I started with. Because like out of the 20 or 30 viewers I started with, there's probably still like a good amount that are, that are still here. Like Prezzo. Midnight on the third day. Zundel, Spiffy. And there's like other names I remember that just aren't here anymore, but I'd still like I'd still like them. It's not I wasn't here that early. Okay, I didn't mean to do it this trip this way. It was just muscle memory. Here we go. Nah, you weren't. You were here like a couple months after. In the grand scheme of things, you were extremely early, but you weren't like... You weren't here before I was like doing runs. Like there was a long time where I wasn't even doing runs, I was just practicing. Not an OG SMH. SMH. I remember the early days of you playing Vampire Survivors. Yeah. Oh, another time that was really fun to stream was when I was in LA, even though LA sucked. And I was playing Deceit all the time. I was playing Deceit Friday the 13th. I think that's like when Dead by Daylight fucking released. That was fun. Dead by Daylight is dog shit now? Let me tell you, bro, it's always been dog shit. It's never not been dog shit. Yeah. 
Back in the day, people would just, there'd be like maps where there'd be like a building with a window in the center, and if someone decided to go in the building and just loop you for eternity, there's like nothing you can do. You'd just walk away. I remember playing to see with you as Windows 98. I don't remember you. <laughs> I feel like I vaguely remember you in Twitch chat. I feel like there was a Twitch chatter named Windows 98. This, it's been a while though. I mean, that's like five years ago. Don't Don't be heartbroken. I only remember like three people by name from Deceit. I I remember like moments that happened, but I don't remember the names of the people. I remember there was like some rush. So like I would play with like randoms in the middle of the night, just get into a random lobby. And there was like some Russian guy who's on my team, but he couldn't speak. Well, okay. It's like, you know, everyone, it's basically Deceit is like two hidden infected on like a six person team. And I think I was infected or something, so I'm just like making up lies. And I make up a lie that the Russian guy is the bad guy, and then the dude just fucking tweaks it. He just flips his shit and just loses it. And he starts yelling at me in like broken English. Oh shit, I always do this. I hate this run. Let me do another one. You guys distracted me too much. <laughs> no, this runs bad too. Wait. It's me. Wait. Mario. There we go. It's me, Mario. How many people do you remember from Friday the 13th? Probably more than Deceit. That game was cool. I heard they're making another game that's like similar to it, kind of, but with a different license. How many people do you remember from Mario Kart? I don't know, a lot of people. You remember my younger brother, Mr. Doral? Yeah. Yeah, I do. He tried to build my computer. Because he said the PC builder that has like 500,000 followers wasn't secure and I should let him do it. Some guy's younger brother built my computer. You didn't do it. No, I, I used the PC, but like the regular one. I remember when Clue was a Fortnite streamer. I played Fortnite before it blew up. The first season where everyone was dressed like medieval knights. Um, I can't believe, I, I wasn't exactly surprised that that game became popular, but I can't believe it became as popular as it was, dude. That was poverty PUBG for a while. Me and Mango played and like Mango didn't even build. The only thing that I ever built was like random walls sometimes. SOS was the Papaya's game. I don't even remember getting stream sniped in Fortnite. Oh wait, what the fuck am I talking about? I got crazy stream sniped in Fortnite.
I would like drop on a house and there'd be like 15 people with pickaxes trying to kill me because they thought it was funny because they were like forcing viewers. I swear, if I did that, like if we go back in time and I continue to like pumping out those streams with that stupid shit, I probably get like way, way more viewers from that. I would have been early as fuck. But I only played it for like a couple weeks or a month. Yeah, I would have met Drake, dude. Damn. I don't think I played it for a month. I think I played it for like a couple weeks. I never farm stuff as much as I could. Like, I should have farmed Among Us way more. <laughs> but I was so sick of it. I didn't want to play that shit. I wasn't as sick of Fortnite. I just think I took a break or something. I milked Among Us dry? Dude, I played Among Us for like 10 days. People played that shit for like a year and a half. I couldn't believe it. Wait. Okay, good. I'd go fucking nuts if I had to play a game that many times in a row, over and over again. Fucking drive me crazy. Everyone played Fall Guys early, and then it kind of petered off. It's still around. It's still okay. It's just, I think the I, the concept is better than the execution. Yeah, they really needed to get like a thousand people and just be like, pump out maps, dude. Pump it out like it's the forge. Just go crazy. They should have stole more Mario Party minigames too. I want that Mario, I want it like a Fall Guys thing where I'm chewing a giant pizza and we have to eat the pizza faster than the other team. I'd also like it if maybe there was like, oh shit, I did the wrong movement. Maybe if there was like a little bit more complicated movement. But I don't think it's totally necessary. Or like the Mario Party minigame where like, you have those drills and you have to like drill a shape. That one's pretty good too. What are the best Mario Party minigames? Almost died there. That was really close. How the fuck am I supposed to remember based on their name, dude? Give me a description. What in the shit is Pokey Pummel? Like, I'm supposed to remember that. Pushy Penguins. Bookworm's the best, no question. I don't even need to say it. There should have been a Bookworm Fall Guys. I I think we actually suggested that to the the dev was like talking to us at the beginning, and he said that one of the first things they tested was a Bookworm in um, Fall Guys form, and they said that the camera was like wrong, like 
since your camera wasn't locked, they were worried that people wouldn't, like, figure out that the page was gonna come from, like, the, that specific direction instantly. So they said that they, they got rid of the minigame. Everyone knows Bookworm's the best. The one where you do the- where you pump up Bowser's pretty good, too. Or the one where... It's in, like, Mario Party 1 where you're, like, a little race car on a track and you're, like, spinning it around. That one's good, too. Mango talked so much shit about Booksquirm and how amazing he was and how I'd never beat him. And then when we played that Mario Party online, I beat him in the Booksquirm. I think I was playing Wario and I boxed him out. Now it's my birthday. Well, it was my birthday. Bro, I was wasted. No, nope, no excuses. No excuses. <laughs> Maybe we'll do it again someday. That Mario Party Online was a huge disappointment because they said they were going to do like a bunch of shit with it and they never did. Oh no! And they said they'd make those maps this- like, do they change those maps for the worse? There were like items that weren't supposed to be there. All sorts of dumb stuff. Are you gonna speed run the new Zelda? I don't know. I'll probably. Tr I, I talked about this last stream, I think, but I kind of regret trying to speed run Breath of the Wild, even though I don't even dislike the speed run for the game. Because when I tried to casually play it again, instead of adding to the game, I felt like it detracted from the game. Whereas Ocarina of Time, it's still fun for me to play, even though I know the tricks. Breath of the Wild is not fun to do the dungeons if you know how to do the dungeons in like two seconds. The dungeons are just too static. Wait, I remember this time. So, um... Because I always figured like, okay, I'm going to forget what happened in Breath of the Wild. I'm going to come back, you know, five years later and it'll still be fun to play casually again. I tried to do that and it wasn't. I just remember too much. All the really cool stuff that you find, you remember. Like that island where you lose all your items, I remember that shit, so I can't be surprised about it again. The stuff that I'm surprised about is like really stupid. Box jump is faster than... Oh, interesting. So it was a good idea for me to do that. Wait, why did I just do this? One of my biggest flaws in 16 star is that I do not remember the star order. Zanata said Breath of the Wild was his favorite game of all time when it came out. I wonder if he still agrees. Zanata's the biggest follower for hype ever. The game will be out for like 24 hours and he's like, best Pokemon ever. What are you doing? Yeah. 
I think it'd be a good idea for me to do 16 at least semi-seriously and care about it when I'm doing it because there's some aspects of 16 that would really benefit my 120 because I mean shit dude I suck at Bowser throws 16 you got to be good at Bowser throws this was a bad split That angle was really weird. I was fighting like as hard as I could just not to fall. <sighs> I probably will start streaming more during the day. Within the next week. Or two. If I had to guess. Yeah, Dylan, your, your splits are sweet. <laughs> I'm a fan. Unfortunately, we'll see how this last split goes. I need to do really quick BLJs. I just went outside like not that long ago. I guess it was dark though. <laughs> he never misses throws. <laughs> never. Missed. God damn it. Hit. 
that'll hit. Looks like Believers escape just barely. I think. Ah, yeah. oh. <laughs> that's a shame. Okay, now let's let's roll back the tape. I think I actually probably had a 0.3 second like roundup. You know what I mean? Like, I'm pretty sure it took me like half a second to hit the button. I'm I'm pretty sure. I think believers should win. That needs to be retimed. Someone go in and find exactly when Mario hits the star, and then see what the timer's at. And then we'll know. Don't don't pay out anyone yet. Don't pay it out. Show me the clip. Just link me, link me the clip of the last 30 seconds of the run and I'll look it up myself. Clip it yourself? I don't know how. Not the right clip. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Here we go. Okay, now we need to retime the beginning of the run. We need to retime the beginning of the run. Point two. Show me the beginning of the run. No, I'm not paying out the doubters. I want to see the beginning. <laughs> I wish I, fig I could understand how to do this. How do I go to like my stream and then roll it back? Here we go. Alright, I got this, I got this. So the timer should start... Wait, what the hell was I doing? Honestly, I think Doubters won. <laughs> Sometimes I start kind of late. That time I started pretty much on the dot. I'll do one more. It's me, Mario. I started maybe just like a little tiny bit early. There's a couple things I did stupidly. Like if I didn't enter HMC twice, I'm probably I'm probably chilling. If I didn't miss Bowser one throw, I would have been chilling. Um Mips was kind of bad. Oh man, dude, I did so many things wrong that run. Mips kind of sucked. 
BLJs weren't perfect. I probably wasted like 20 seconds, 15 seconds on BLJs. Missed a Bowser throw. Reentered HMC. Got. I tied Dylan's record. That's like a minute of mistakes. Yeah, but box triple only saves, like box, I don't know. I'm not even sure if I will do box triple every time. I might do it just cause it's, yeah, you know what, I will do it. It's good practice. I'm pretty good at it. LBLJ saves a fuckload of time. I'm not exactly sure how much, like a lot. Yeah, we should have retimed Dylan's run too, that's true. I bet Dylan just like split half a second early. Yeah, Dylan, are you on an emulator? Glaze 90, thanks for so. This might fuck up. Ooh. Oh, okay, so he is on emulator. So that means that Believer's won. I've made a huge mistake. I know it's already paid out, it's fine. <laughs> Dylan, you got a 12.4 on an emulator? That doesn't count. That's like a 12.7 on the N64. You enjoy 16 way more than 70 or 120? Is it because you get to like the dramatic part way quicker? As far as like playing, it's more fun to play 120 for me for sure. But I could see that from like a viewer perspective. I like it when he plays Epic 7. I've never played Epic 7 on stream. I haven't played Epic 7 in like three years. One twenty has like a different kind of excitement though, because it's like a slow build, and then like once it's built up, I don't know. It's still exciting.
Yeah, the chokes are super <laughs> hard in 120. Yeah, when you're like deep in a 120 run and I like die in a 100 coin or something, it's pretty fucking soul crushing. Dead Space Remake is out. If I didn't like the first Dead Space, should I still play that? Did it actually like just just come out? Like it came out three hours ago? Oh, it comes out next week. Okay. I don't know, maybe. I'd give it a try. I don't think Callisto being a flop has anything to do with Dead Space. I think a big reason why Callisto flopped was they were they went they probably started making that game where we're like, let's make Dead Space. What kind of creative fucking process is that? And then when they found out that Dead Space was actually being made, they're like, holy fuck, we have to get this thing out before Dead Space. Which made it so they probably rushed it. Yeah, that's stupid. Don't bet believe for a while, all right? I, I need to work something out. It's me, Mario. Oh, it's made by the original Dead Space devs. Oh, well then never mind on that first point. But still, they, they probably did rush it to try and get it out before Dead Space Remastered. No way you just did that? Oh, I did. I don't know what that is, JFC. You look like a Chelsea fan. I don't really give a shit about soccer. I pay a little bit of attention to it, but I don't root for a team specifically. A lot of the time I feel bad for the teams that everyone hates on. Like everyone was hating on Liverpool, so I wasn't a fan of them, but I felt kind of bad for them. Oh shit. Can you guys not pay out doubters, please? Just void the bet. What do you mean rules are rules? I make the rules. How about this? This bet is for this run. There we go, perfect. <laughs> 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 
that's just even even it out, even it out, all right? We've had some doubters getting some points that don't make any goddamn sense for a while. Just even it out. Thanks for the 100 bits, Merzard. I'll continue. <laughs> I like how a, a fuck ton of money just went on doubt right when I failed that. <laughs> I don't know who did that. Thanks, Clint. The payout will be good now. I got you. <laughs> Do you have a favorite Naruto character? Rock Lee. Yeah, me and Mango both like Rock Lee, I remember that. I don't understand how anyone could like anyone other than Rock Lee. As their favorite. He's easily the best character. Unless he like... Those edgelord characters that are like really brooding. His hair's really dumb. Who cares? The better written characters? Come on, dude. It's Naruto. There's no good... There's no well-written characters. <laughs> Hitachi? I don't even know who Hitachi is. Are you talking about the guy who like burned down his the village or something for some stupid reason? Hitaji's the wand. Oh, okay. <laughs> you didn't even watch Naruto? I watched the pain arc and I thought it was actually pretty decent. But the problem was the end of the pain arc was so um, deflating to me that I decided never to watch any more Naruto ever again. The ending was like, okay, there's been all this loss, all these good moments. Let's just reset everything back like it's a fucking sitcom, except give Naruto like ninja jesus powers to like you know mind convince someone so that they res everyone it's so stupid <laughs> talk no jutsu
It was the thing is check it was impactful. It's just like it felt like they reset everything. It felt like God came in and was just like, okay, yeah, let me just rescue all the good guys because I feel like it. It's like, what, what the fuck? What's your ninja way? I'm a waterbender. Feels bad if Ninja Jesus comes and reses the whole city and you're not one of the people that gets rezzed. It's like they just forgot that you existed. It's like, oh yeah, that guy. I don't know. I just kind of forgot about him, I guess. Too late now. <laughs> I'm hitting every one of these things. I'm sorry, Mario. <laughs> just keep tanking, bro. This angle's weird. Stupid Goomba. Rooting my line. I only really do 16 star in races. And in races, they don't normally do Lobby BLJ, so I don't really feel motivated to, like, actually do it. I would feel motivated to do it if my 120 t star time got better. Then I would... Then I would seriously look into it. At, like, getting consistent with it. I know how to do it. Thanks for sub Bazoots. Shit. I don't really look at Twitter DMs much. But thank you for the sub. Why is Sunshine not a more popular speedrun? I think it is pretty popular. Do you mean like why isn't it more popular than SM64? I think people just as like a basic game like SM64 more than Sunshine. That's it. I fucked this up. I don't know why I forgot my movement there. Another thing too is like, I remember thinking that Sunshine wasn't really that good when I was younger, but when I replayed it, it was really good. So, I don't know. Maybe other people feel that way. There's a lot of people that when Sunshine came out were like super disappointed with it. A lot. I think it's because I was older when Sunshine came out. You guys were probably all like three when Sunshine came out, so... Of course you're gonna like it, you're three. You're just gonna walk around in the hub world and like, spray your little... flood thing around.
when I'm older than you and Sunshine was sick? I choose not to believe you. I choose to disregard your comment. In Sunshine, I just remember the blue coins being really annoying. I think. I think it was the blue. Wait. What the fuck? But no, I mean, it's a good game, in retrospect. I think the casual play of it was just too hard for me when I was younger. Or maybe like a couple of the stars were just too hard and I was just too stubborn to like not do those stars. Stop it. Weird. I remember that door being really easy and now it's like the harder one. Like Sunshine, I remember really getting stuck on the water level with like all the grates and stuff and like the octopus. And then the other stage that like made me stop playing was that hotel stage with like the stingrays in the ground. Dude, that shit's hard. Yeah, I know you can cheese the Stingray, but I didn't know that when I was younger. It doesn't matter, I gotta wait anyways. <laughs> okay, now it kind of matters. Hurry up. Is mind control me doing this? Well, you guys worked on that fast. Thanks for sub, Lando. Why do people pretend to like Twilight Princess now just to make Breath of the Wild look bad? Now there's people that liked it before Breath of the Wild. Back in the day, nobody liked that shit. Stop it.
but over time people have definitely warmed up to it or have been more comfortable like admitting that they like it Because I didn't like it back then either, but I do kind of have an appreciation for it after replaying it. The beginning is horrible. Oh, why did I not triple jump? The overworld is empty as fuck. The wolf parts are kind of stupid, but man, it's got some pretty good dungeons. I'm gonna try and change controllers in this run. And that's a big deal. Like the dungeon thing. <laughs> oh my god. Believers, I'm sorry. Dude, is it really going to happen again? <laughs> I'm sick of this shit! Oh, I forgot to start the split. I can't retime it. There's no way a retime is gonna save me a second and a half. I have to do another. I can't. I can't miss his time by like two. Oh, yeah! Dude, I did beat him because he did an emulator. Pay out the believers. That's fair. Oh, too late? Shit. Casavan, thanks for the sub. <laughs> How about you pay out believers no matter what? I should just be like, will I break the world record this run? Have people load up on doubt? One guy bets 10 points on believe. And then I just arbitrarily decide to pay out believers and all the money goes to one guy. That's called scamming. That's based. Are you allowed to do that? Yeah, if I... Yeah, I'm pretty sure Twitch will ban me if I do my fake point payouts wrong. They'll be like, no, you, you can't do this. The sanctity of our fake casino. Oh shit. <laughs> Clint was banned for three months. Because he accidentally paid out believers <laughs> one time. <laughs> they should ban you.
I just realized something. Someone asked me a couple days ago how to do Owlist, and I gave like a three paragraph explanation and I explained it to him wrong. <laughs> Rip that guy. I just realized I told him to hold up when I meant to tell him to hold left. No way that guy's fucking succeeding anytime soon. <laughs> if you're here in chat watching, random person, you're supposed to- You let go of neutral, so like you let go of up and then you only hold left. You do not hold up and then left. You just hold up. No, you just hold left. Sorry, I'm contradicting myself. No. Wait! Okay, there's a very- oh wait, never mind. We're good. I was gonna say, probably gonna crash, but we're safe. I've never seen someone lose a run like that. Dude, I've lost run- like, tons of runs like that. Why the fuck am I hit 20 seconds? Alright. I have a problem with my capture card, where when the connection gets a little bit loose, it makes my computer shut down. For some reason, it swapped from HDMI to DisplayPort, and I thought that meant that it was getting loose. I'll be back in a sec. Thanks, Subtle. For those who don't know, it was my birthday yesterday. Fuck. Oh yeah, I just realized. I haven't had Streamlabs up, or whatever the fuck it's called. Okay, you can't- you're not allowed to bet anymore. for the moment. I think if bets are still going on and like I'm obviously gonna reset, then... You sh it's voided, basically. Okay, now I'm good. Cast event, thanks for some. Pillow-esque. Thanks, Vissa. T-Pain tweeted your stream? I doubt that. Vagabond, thanks, Vissa. Did Lud give you another bidet for your birthday? No. Nah. It's just a quirk of SM64 runs. This is the last run I'm gonna do, and then I'm gonna play something else. Dorami Yuki, thanks for the sub. Here we go. 
I believe in this run. How do you cage consistently? Is it angle? No. It doesn't really matter. You want to triple at the end of the platform for sure. You want to make sure when you start doing your like jumps, you don't let go of up. Like you're just up all the way the whole time. And then I don't know, it's just kind of a feeling thing for like, you want to release neutral and then hold left. So it's just kind of like, I don't really think about it, it just, it normally works. What I meant by only left is that after you triple jump, you go and release the stick for like a brief moment. I'm not even sure exactly how long I would describe it, maybe like three tenths of a second. It depends, I don't know. That's the part where I'm not even sure how long I go to neutral. I basically just go to neutral and then start holding left. And then as long as your wall kick isn't like really slow, it doesn't really matter. Like if you're gonna succeed or fail has already been decided. You just hope. It's not really any adjustments you can make. What trick took you the longest to get a hang of? I don't know about singular trick. I guess pillarless took a long time to get comfortable with. Probably that. I'm not sure if you could count Bowser throws as a trick. But I've also not spent a ton of time doing Bowser throws. I've spent a lot of time doing pillarless. Like, a lot of time. So I'm considering it like, what have I spent the most time trying to figure out? If you mean like entire stages, I mean, there's a lot of good answers. TikTok, 100 coin. It's just your definition of like, do you want me to say a stage that I'm not really very good at at all? Or do you want me to say a stage that I'm pretty good at that I've spent a lot of time on? I fuck, I thought I fell. I don't even know if this will work. We're gonna hope it does. You spend a lot of time on Wamps and you're not very good. Wamps is hard. But in comparison to a lot of other stages, like, there's some later stages that I'm much worse on than Wamps. Like, Wamps, I don't lose a ton of time if I do everything pretty well. Like, up to my standard, I don't lose a ton of time over like other 120 star runners compared to some of my other stages. Some of my other stages, I'm like bleeding time like crazy. I'm still losing time, don't get me wrong, but. SM64 is kind of crazy, because it'll always reward you for putting in more time. So as long as the best people keep playing, 
they're gonna keep pushing it and pushing it. Oh shit. That I got. Especially with the advent of Twitch, it's like there's always gonna be someone out there that's like, you know what? <laughs> Let me play 14 hours a day. I'm feeling this shit. You game for 18 hours a day for like nine years? What did you play? What was your game of choice? Oh, that didn't work? What the fuck? LOL WoW Warframe Path of Exile Minecraft. I think MMOs are a little bit different, but I don't know why. I guess it's just like really easy to put in a ton of time into MMOs. It's like they convince you to do that almost. How do you even play for 18 hours a day every day? You're having fun, man. I know that feeling. I still love playing video games. It's not, not the same amount of hours. I only ever hear you complain about video games. What have I ever complained about video games? I have over 400 hours in Genshin, fake gamers in chat. 400 hours in Genshin is nothing. There's people in chat that have like 28,000 hours in RuneScape. There was a guy in chat who had 30,000 hours in Guns the Duel. <laughs> Gigabait. That Guns the Duel guy was like three years ago. Yeah, but he's my favorite answer for that. He probably has like 40,000 hours now. I've played over 100,000 games of Melee in two years. How much time would that be, you think? Four minutes a game, that's 400,000 minutes. Well, how much, how many hours is that then? I don't want to do the math, <laughs> I'm fucking, what are you, a doubter? Just do the math, do the math for me. What is this shit? I don't want to have to do fucking long division while I'm playing Mario 64. 5,000 to 8,000 hours. Thank you. Oh, thank you. 
If you have like 300 days in Counter-Strike, why aren't you a pro yet? <laughs> oh, just be a pro. Why don't you have the SM64 world record yet? I don't have like 10,000 hours in SM64. I have more hours in Ocarina of Time still. As strange as that might seem. I should sign a team of Counter-Strike players that never get a chance, but are beasts. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. I could easily have wall jumped off that. But for some reason, my brain was like, I don't need to wall jump off it. I think I'm just going to make it anyways. There's no downside to me just pressing A there. It was so stupid. Oh well. Someone asked me what emulators do I use? I'm not playing on emulator right now, but, um, actually I don't even think I have an emulator on this computer. Other than Dolphin, but that's, that's for like GameCube games. Um, used to use Project 64, which is probably what a lot of people tell you to use, but you have to use an older version of it that nobody can ever find, so then people always have to ask me for it, which is a pain in the ass. I don't even have it anymore. I don't remember. Um, yeah, Moopin's one. I never used Moopin. I used to use Project 64. Now, if I'm practicing, which I haven't really been recently, but I might in the future, I have a EverDrive, but they're kind of expensive. It's like a cartridge you plug into your N64, you put an SD card in it, and you can have like save states and stuff, but you're playing the game exactly the way that it would feel on an N64. That'll work. Dude, I thought it was gonna be that thing where I'd fall down the staircase and the next staircase. You can get a fake EverDrive for like 40 bucks. Why would I do that? You're probably gonna get hacked if you have a fake one. Wow, that was perfect. Have faith, believers. Okay, you can panic now. <laughs> I 
If I had a good end to this, I could have got like a low 17. I forgot how to do it. There we go. I think it's easier for me if I'm close to the edge. I'm just gonna make sure I'm close to the edge for now. As a believer, I've never had more than 10,000 points. Well, I said that'd be my last one. But I kind of want to do another one. One more. What's the quickest you've done Bowser three throws? It's tough because you don't split when you enter the pipe. So it's always just a continuation of like, whatever your other, you know, whatever Bowser in the sky was. Um, and it's a little bit different depending on like, if you're doing it in 16 star, you're doing it in 70 or 120, because you're starting from different places. I'm not sure. I've had some pretty fast Bowser 3 throws, but they're very rare. Because <laughs> a lot of the time, I'm just trying not to fuck up. So I'm not... Like, if I do an extra spin to feel a little bit more comfortable, it's not the end of the world. Especially since a lot of the time I'm doing, like, 120. How do I give money to this guy? I just want to support testing out Twitch chat members work or whatever. Uh, I have a PayPal. Are you talking about me? Or are you talking about someone else? I'd like to get a 1730 this run. Or lower. I feel like if I have a pretty basic run with like no mistakes, I'm getting like a 16 minutes something. But there's always significant mistakes.
No, there was more mistakes I was making for sure. Not as not as big as the ending though. The ending was pretty insane. Um, I mean, they're gonna do Ocarina of Time or play Untitled Goose Game. Hey, can you play Untitled Goose Game with a controller? Or is it keyboard? Cool. I'd rather play with controller. Hey, do people still play that, like, ping pong soccer game with 3v3 that was made by, like, the Riot devs? Oh, shit. No. That game was alright, man. Yeah, Mega Strikers. Might miss. Weird. Here we go. Mario Strikers Charge. Is that the one on the GameCube or the Wii? I, I think that's my favorite. If it's the one on the Wii. That one's sweet. The new one that came out, I didn't really like that much. Yeah, that one was awesome. Top five Wii games. Xenoblade, easy one. Then two, can I say the Metroid Prime Collection? <laughs> or is that cheating? I guess Twilight Princess would be up there, but probably I'm not like in love with it or anything. I don't know, Wii Sports? <laughs> Mario Strikers Charged, I guess? I wasn't really big on the Mario Kart Wii game. Mario Galaxy, I wasn't a big fan of. It was too easy. Skyward Sword, I did play, yeah. When I replayed Twilight Princess, I liked it more than when I replayed Skyward Sword. But when I played Skyward Sword for the first time, I liked it more than Twilight Princess, so I don't know. Odyssey I liked. I liked it a lot more than Galaxy. I didn't like Galaxy's movement. It felt like you could just like basic jump and long jump and that was it. Whereas in Odyssey, you could do more. Metroid Dread is so much better than the Primes. I love Metroid Fusion, and I couldn't even finish Dread. I don't even, I, I, I have no idea why. I dislike that game, but I did. I didn't like exploring. Too much TikTok ruined your brain? <laughs> I don't even use TikTok. I don't have it installed. Nah, I never had a PSP. 
prove it right now? No, I'm not gonna prove it. You'd look at you'd be able to see all the other dumb shit I haven't solved. You'd see all my gotcha games. Why are we paying out doubters? I haven't done anything wrong yet. No, I don't play uh, Nike. I tried it, but I didn't really like it. I like Nike more than Reebok. I feel like sometimes you mispronounce things on purpose. Yeah, I do that sometimes. Typically when it's a, when I say the word pesuito, <laughs> I've been told enough times how to pronounce it that you would think I would learn at this point. Yeah, Suda. Valorant, I still don't know the correct way to say it, so that doesn't count. I still haven't learned. Man, you guys really hate Valorant. I haven't done any 70s today because I keep getting frustratingly close on like good 16 star runs and then I keep screwing up. It's annoying. Man, I'm hitting them like every time. Do people still pretend that Fortnite's bad? Probably. I mean, there was a valid reason for like lots of people disliking it. It really did suck if like you hadn't really played much Fortnite and then all of a sudden you go in and someone builds like the Sistine Chapel around you. It's pretty stupid. Oh, come on. Dude, what the fuck? Yeah. 
I think there's a lot of people who just have... They're just sick of Battle Royale games. So any Battle Royale game they're not gonna like. Which is understandable. There was like a million of them. Pokemon MOBA still popular? I don't think so. That was fun to play for a little bit. I still hate Zapdos, and they like got rid of Zapdos, but they didn't change it enough. Come on! Can't I just get a good run? This runs 18 minutes. Why can't I just get a good run where nothing stupid happens in 18 minutes? Just one. Maybe I'll do Untitled Goose Game and just chalk up today to close, but not quite. You were still up. I was gonna lose at least a minute. Do you have a book recommendation? I read um, Hard Boiled Wonderland, The End of the World. Maybe like a month ago. I thought it was good. I like, um, rolled doll books. <laughs> if you want to go old school. I just don't, I don't even, I'm not even totally familiar with the OT run at this point, but um, Ocarina of Time, I just don't, I'm good. It's... It's very unforgiving. It's very, very unforgiving. And I know that if I spent the time to learn some of it, it's still... I'd get tired of it. It's fun to learn new tricks, but it's really boring to just like bang your head against the wall over and over. In a really long runs especially. There's like a sweet spot. It's, you don't want it too short so that you're basically just watching an intro cutscene over and over again, but you also don't want it too long so that you play really well for four hours, you do poorly in 10 minutes, and it's like, well, shit. That's it for me.
I don't think they have intro anymore for Ocarina of Time, which, you know, I don't really care about. Fuck, I'm not supposed to do this. Here we go. No, no interest. Yeah, it's 419.22, er, ish. It's close to that. XQC said he's doing Goose Game and I'll take all your viewers. <laughs> That sounds fake. Here we go. It sounds like you just want me to do more runs. What's Goose Game? Uh, it's some silly game that came out like a year or two ago. I don't know, you just run around as a goose and just annoy people. I'm not even sure exactly what you're supposed to be doing. It's like a... I don't know, just look it up on Steam or something. It's like five years old. Man, what the fuck, really? <laughs> oh, come on. What I was trying to do was walk in a certain way so that I would get a side flip. And instead, for whatever reason, the game decided to not give me the side flip. So instead, I just walked in a wide circle. Fuck it. Might want to close prediction. Why are we predicting so late? Okay, that's cool. Yeah, this will be the last run. I know I've said that like three times in a row, but it really will be. I'll play some variety shit for a little bit. Probably won't do a super long stream, but it was my birthday, so nobody can complain. The problem is, even if I beat my time now. I know I can do better, so I was hoping that I would get a 16 star that I'm like somewhat satisfied with tonight, at least for the time being. But since our first two splits were so bad, that's impossible now.
I played a lot of horror games in the past. Um, I played a lot of crappy horror games too, which kind of made me not want to play some of the recent ones that have come out. I have a couple on my wish list that I could play, but I don't feel like playing a horror game tonight. I used to get crazy scared when I played horror games, but I don't really anymore. Um, the big thing that I still can't do, even after all this time, is... Narrow hallway, door at the end, open door slowly, and you have to open it yourself. I hate that shit. Hey, thanks for $5. Pablo... In... No funny? Pablo, you know, oh, Tony. Thanks for $5, dude. I don't know how to say his name. He doesn't have any capitals in his name. I'm just making up stuff. I appreciate it, dude. Be janky. Thanks for sub. Corin, thanks for sub. Thanks for the $2. Jesse, hey, Clint. The moon here. Heard you have a short but wide PP. <laughs> I said urethra, that's different. But yeah, no, you're correct. Still waiting for you to rematch me in Hangar. There's no rematch, you lost. If he starts playing Hangar again randomly, I'll come back. But first things he, he's gotta do is beat my old time. Why hanger and not another stage? Yeah, I don't know. I just did it despite Moon Moon. I, I I'm not really sure why he picked hanger in the first place. It just kind of happened. Hey, what's up, Lucari? Hangar is pretty sweet. It is one of the better stages. Why isn't Lakari modded? I mean, he could be. Most of the time, just. I don't want other streamers to feel like they have to deal with, like, mod duties. So VIP is the same thing. I think he is VIP. Lakari's a loser. I'm saying this before he's modded. Well, he's not going to be modded, so... <laughs> but please don't... Call him a loser. He's not a loser. He's a winner. Shit. Dude, you're VIP. What do you want to be mod for? It's like the same thing. Lucari, I got people from chat that make it seem like I ruined your life by telling you about Epic 7, which I think is weird because... I basically was just like, hey, Crack's pretty cool. It's not my fault that he went and fucking ran with it. They're trying to get me to stop playing, to stop you from playing, but... I think the easiest way to do that was would be to just get you to play a different gacha game. 
So I don't know if that's really improving or not. Like, maybe I'm replacing your crack with just like... I don't know. Alcohol or something. Binge drinking. Comparing crack and alcohol, basically the same thing. Oh shit. No. Why would you spin that way? That fucked up everything. This run isn't the perfect run, but I think it'll be good enough. As long as I don't fail this. I think I'm good. Sweet. Excellent. So it's running Pablo. Wait, hola. So now I helped E figure this out. Here's this cuz Zerm Chad got my name and this is for them. Twitch is cool. Thank you. Yeah, I'll make sure to share this with Chad. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for five dollars, Pablo. Fuck, I said ten. Whoops. No, that's okay. Loud stick, thanks for the sub. Hey, Lakari, what good, like, variety games have you been playing lately? I want to steal some ideas. Other than that. Other than gotcha games. Wow, that was really good. I don't even know what to do for the movement when that happens. possible for believers to win. It's possible. Oh, that's weird, the controller wouldn't fit in. That's good. That's good. This is gonna be weird though, because he's gonna be more in the center, it's gonna make it harder. Oh, shit. <laughs> Very nice. So let's think about this. 
I could have saved like I could have been like minus 30 at CCM. I got slow cycle on um Bowser in the Fire Sea, whatever the fuck it's called. I was like pretty slow on my MIPS. 17.45, not bad. Also, I think Bowser when I fucked up something, but I can't remember what exactly. Oh, maybe I didn't. Oh, world record's like way, 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 way lower. <laughs> This ain't even close, bro. Also, I need to start doing Lobby BLJ, which would save a fuck ton of time. Um. But for races, you typically don't do Lobby BLJ. So, I don't, uh, I'm mostly just doing this to see what I can get but I'm also practicing for races in general. Not bad. Not bad. It's up to you, Umbra. Probably not. What's a lobby, whatever you said? You know when I was going up the stairs and I went like, duh, 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 like a beast? That's a BLJ. Lobby BLJ means that in the first lobby, like the main room, you BLJ in like a really weird fucking way so that you can skip to Bowser 1 first. So you'd skip to Bowser 1, you... the basement stars are quicker than like the mid-floor stars. So you just skip mid-floor, go all basement. Um, I know all the basement stars, but... it would be harder. For sure. Yeah, I've successfully done it. It's not that difficult, but it's annoying. Okay, I'm gonna do variety. Fuck it. It was my birthday yesterday. I gotta do what I want. I'll save this. So we're not going against Dylan anymore. Sorry, Dylan. Wait. Yes, wait. This better not save over my 120. I'm gonna save these. Uh, uh. Okay, good. Excellent. Donkey Kong 64, I'm not gonna do today. Sorry, bro. But I will do it in the future. Let's look at my Steam library. Check it. Hey, wait, why doesn't this work? Oh, there we go. Man, Super Psycho Baseball. Now that was a game. I hate Tarkov. I despise it. We're not playing that. Death and Taxes look kind of cool. But I'm not playing that today. Hypnospace Outlaw looked really cool. I guess I could play that. Untitled Goose Game looked kind of cool, but you guys said it's five years old. Fuck that. Fabric of Reality. You probably made that game. Tell you what, I'll add it to my wish list. Yeah, I'll play Goose Game. Fuck it. Let's try it out. Let me get my. Oh, here it is. We'll try it out. If I don't like it, I can always just play something else, but I think I will like it. <laughs> I 
I'm Dirk Hardpeck. <laughs> How do you not know that? What's my favorite what? Everhood? I've never heard of. Small chip, thanks for the sub. What's that? I want that. Maybe I just need to build up speed. Oh. oh. So right triggers, I flap my wings. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> oh well. Oh, interesting. Dude, this is like, there's a lot of controls in this. This is some movement. I thought my whole purpose was to annoy people and steal their shit. How do I eat this? So if, is the objective of this game just to be a annoying duck bastard? Oh, I guess I'm a goose, not a duck. Maybe it's like a Metroidvania. I'm seeing all these doors I can't get to. Whoa. There's a lot of people. Oh, I have objectives. <laughs> My to-do list. Get into the garden. Steal the keys. Make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat. Rake in the lake. Have a picnic. Bring to the picnic blanket. Sam okay, well, I already fucked that up. Hey, that it. <laughs> Nothing suspicious here. I want those. Stop it. Is that the picnic blanket? This thing? Or is it something else? Oh, it's under it. Yeah, go in the water. Yeah, that's right. Oh, here we go. I probably need those keys for something, but I'm not sure what exactly. Just chilling.
Is there any way I can eat stuff? <laughs> Dude, this guy's. I feel kind of bad for fucking up this guy's garden. This guy's got a good garden. What was my objective? Make the groundskeeper wear his sun hat? I'm sneaking this. So I need. Another sandwich, pumpkin, carrot. Oh, dude, I need, like, everything. All right. But I can't stop. The game's forcing me to be evil. Is this game actually hard at some point? No, it's mine. Mine now. <laughs> this is for safekeeping. There are secret objectives. Interesting. Hey, what do you think his keys are for? Like his house? <laughs> so you can fuck his wife. Let's do it. Yeah, I was thinking that, but the problem is the lock's on the wrong side, so I'm not sure if I can really do it. This guy notices every time I do that. <laughs> Alright, I give up. Take your jam. It's all about diversions. Jam. Oh, I do need the jam. Thermos? Radio and basket. Wow, okay. I need to just pillage this guy's house completely then. Wait, do I need this? No, I don't. This needs to go in the lake. But I don't know how to, oh, here we go. Here, look at this pumpkin, dude. Look at this pumpkin. I'm being bad. I'm going to turn this on. <laughs> He's going to get his shotgun. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna put this stuff over here so he doesn't notice it. It's not in America, you're safe. How do you know where it takes place?
This duck is like Juno. This goose is like Juno, I mean, not duck. I don't know why I keep saying duck. What would you do if a goose was doing this to you? Uh, probably befriend them. I don't like confrontation, you know. Hey, sup? <laughs> Stop it, dude. He deserves this. This is karma retribution. Is that a brick? I wonder what else I could do to like really make this guy uh distracted. I guess maybe like show his keys again. That might be a good idea. He's kinda getting jacked though, he's losing all his stuff. Is this the basket? Cause this doesn't look like a basket to me. Where's it's probably like a not sure what. I need to make him use his hat to Hey, where that I forgot I could do that. <laughs> I've reached new levels of annoying. Look at me. It doesn't look like he has a picnic basket. I need a radio too. When I get really old, I'm gonna care about my yard. Or maybe not. That's just like something I'm assuming. Hey, if you're really old and you don't wanna take care of your yard, can you just like rip up all the grass so you don't have to water it anymore? I don't want to live in the desert though, it's too hot. I'd rather just live somewhere with grass and then rip it all up. <laughs> Get AstroTurf. Wait, no, it doesn't go here. That doesn't look right. I've made a mistake. Hey! My duck is stuck! Yeah, that counts. Microplastic is a bitch. There's just some things you gotta live with, man. Microplastics is one of them. If they find out that we're all gonna grow a fourth arm out of our heads because of microplastics, it is what it is. I'm just gonna keep turning this on. Okay, I'm in third. You get what I'm saying? How is this thing's playing noise? Fuck. I'm going in the lake. I'm going in the lake. Excellent. I still don't know where the basket is. What the fuck? Why are you doing this to me? Yoink. How can he outrun a fucking me and my prime element? You've just made a grave mistake, my friend. 
<laughs> a grave mistake. No, pick it up. Pick it up. These rocks. I'm just going to stay here for a while and hopefully he gives up. I'm going to hide. Now you can't catch me. He's going to get like halfway in the water and then he's going to realize that he doesn't know where I went. Whoops. No, why would I squeak at him? He's just going to notice me then. All right, I think he gave up. Perfection. How do I, I want to steal this guy's wallet. I can see this game pretty getting pretty dark at the end. You guys were like, it's like going and steal his diabetes medication. <laughs> Why would you need money? Ducks can't buy anything. Uh, I don't know, just to have it, I guess. I'm not having the picnic either. Dump his insulin in the lake. Let me hit. Bring to, okay, make the groundskeeper hammer his thumb. That sounds really hard. I'm just gonna squeak it in when I see him doing something. What's up? You can kill him with the brick? I don't believe you. We're friends. He's not hammering anything though. That's I need to watch him hammer something. Grab the shotgun he keeps in the shed. Oh, here we go. I see how I do this. Man, this is discrimination. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Take the brick, finish the job. I like put my neck down like this. It's like I'm building up speed. I'm Naruto running. I never made him wear his sun hat. I guess I could do that. Is it unrealistic to try and do everything on the to-do list, or is it, um, I guess I can try it. Hmm. Also, it's kind of puzzly. It's like, how the fuck would I get him to do that? It's almost like I need to get it to rain or like get really sunny or something. I could take it. Oh, dude, I take his hat. And then he puts on a different hat because he's bald. Hey, bud. Run! 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 
What if he's not bald? I can see that he's bald. I just know these things. He's wearing an old man hat. Yoink. There you go, you're welcome. This guy's so mad. Someone said lock him out of the garden and now I really wanna do that. What would be the best way to do that? I need to steal his keys and put them away again. I'll just put it where the hat is. I don't think he can catch me in time. Oh, maybe. Uh. Okay, so now he's gonna put on the hat. Teabagging. <laughs> this is my stance. So I need to distract him outside somehow. Which I think the best way to do that would be to flip this. And then while he's doing that, I get the key and then lock him out. Go, 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 go. I, he's going to do it too quick. I'll bring the keys closer. Oh, you don't need the key to do it? Really? Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, this is going to be really easy then. This guy's screwed. Nothing suspicious is happening. my house now I run these streets can you do something with the cement uh, I'm not sure I got two achievements, so I feel like I'm probably pretty done. Cool. Break the broom. Trap the boy in the phone booth. Oh, this, this, why am I so evil, man? And make the boy wear the wrong glasses. Steal his lunch money. Get on TV. Go shopping. Put in the basket. Toothbrush. Loo paper? What is that? Toilet paper? This game must be like a UK game. Tinned food. Have you met geese? Yeah, they're kind of dicks. Hey, I'd like to come in. Hmm. So this is like a what what I'm not <laughs> What the fuck? That other guy wasn't even that bad. Dude, he's he's getting some serious 
He's gonna get his comeuppance, man. That's all I'm saying. Hey, there's the toothbrush I need. Not a very clean toothbrush. Put in the basket. Okay. I need a basket. Hey, do I have to get the basket from before? We're probably not. Okay, good. Probably this one. Perfect. Hey, you like this? Where's the phone booth? <laughs> Get away, nerd. <laughs> oh, shit. I cannot find this thing. All right, fine, you can have it. I need to, I need to find this. Oh, I thought I'd be able to open that. He looks exactly like you. Kinda, kinda true. I need a hairbrush. Trap the boy in the phone with break the broom. I do wanna break that broom, it's an annoying one. Make him wear the wrong glasses. What else do I need to do? Make someone buy back their own stuff. See that I have no idea how I'm gonna do. I like how he's just still looking over there. I need cleaner. Is this cleaner, you think? Fruit and veg. I got new glasses for you, dude. Put them on quick. Put them on quick. <laughs> Oh, here it is. Oh, you kicked in the water. Hmm, how do I get this guy to go in the phone booth? He needs to like call someone. Hmm, I wanna tie his shoelaces together. <laughs> it feels wrong. <laughs> Did I tie his shoelaces together? Oh, I'm sorry, dude. What? Dude, you're taking all my shit. I hate this shopkeeper. He's not letting me steal all this stuff. Where's your broom? Fuck. Put him on, dude. Put him on. I'm here to help. How do I break this fucking thing? Move, hurry. Hmm. Now we get to the puzzle. How do I manipulate the broom? I need to like stick it in a something for leverage.
Now it's too close to the shop. Hmm. We'll figure it out. I think it's something up here. Nothing suspicious is happening. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Nothing suspicious. Do you ever have to go to old areas to complete tasks? Probably not. Yeah, break it. I'm just not strong enough. Yeah, but... Like, if I could stick it in between something... Like a fence, that would be good. I still don't understand it getting this area. Maybe it is like downright. I don't know, it doesn't really look like anything over there is like something that I can use to break it. I'm sure I can go in that store because it says that I have to get on TV somehow. Mm, for now, we'll just leave it. I'll I'll figure out something. Like, if I could stick it in between these bars and then pull, that might work. Let's try that. Maybe. Problem is I can't really, like, push it, you know? Yeah, it doesn't really look like it's gonna let me do it. This is my shield. <laughs> Back, demon! <laughs> How does that not work? Yeah, where's your broom, bitch? That's right. Now you're hopeless against me. No! No! Hey, can you get me in this in this area? Oh, you think you're so tough? I already know you're scared of me. Hello? I have an idea. I want to bring this up to the door and see if he opens it. Hey, look at me. Okay, that didn't work. <laughs> he needs to get in the phone booth too. Maybe he'll go in the phone booth if he has no glasses. Oh, uh, not really. He just sits there. I guess I could give him the wrong glasses again. I thought he was wearing the wrong glasses. Wait, I want to hit that switch. That looks good. There we go. Hey, how the fuck did you get your broom back? He seriously found it? Oh shit, I need to hide that better. Let me try and figure out a way to get into that other area. I'm gonna move my basket farther away so that they don't just jack my shit next time, too. I'm 
I'll put it like here. All right, where's the kid? Dude, you're still looking for your glasses? Just learn to see. <laughs> that kid j looks just like you. I already said he does, all right? Don't bully me. Go in the phone booth. I'm sick of this shit. Get in there. There you go. Hey, take this. This is yours now. I'm on TV! Why didn't he just go in the room? He's calling his mom. He could have just waved at the door or something. Break it! Break it! Yes! Excellent. What else do we need to do? Go shopping, make someone buy back their own stuff. I just want to see him pick up the airplane and like put it with his his things. Good. All right, nice. I think we're figuring this out. Time to go shopping. Hey, does stealing count as shopping? Don't snitch, kid. <laughs> yeah, I've already given him the wrong pair of glasses, I think. I can't remember um, if he has the right ones or not. At one point, he had the wrong ones. I need fruit and vegetables. Okay. I always forget. Tomatoes are fruits, right? No! She's gonna notice my stash! Just get away from the stash! What advice do you have for me to be more like you? Grow taller. I need a hairbrush and tin food. I don't think dropping out is a necessity. Is there a hairbrush in the store? Oh yeah, there is, shit. I gotta be sneaky. How does she just know? I, why in the fuck is she still using the broom? That's also a good question. Hey kid, wanna buy some crack? <laughs> oh my God, she found the stash, dude. Why the fuck did she run over there?
Use the walkie talkies. You know, I saw those. I haven't used them at all. That's a good. She took my fruit. We need to run. Oh man, it's too heavy, dude. Maybe she'll forget about the rest of this stuff. I just need to get the fruit in there before she does whatever she's gonna do. If I can just drop it in there for a split second. Book it. Book, no. Oh my God. All right, speed run time. Yeah, get your broom. Neck drop down for extra speed. Get, oh. There we go. Trap the shopkeeper in the garage. Wow, I have no idea how to do that. Holy crap. Maybe the walkie, oh, okay. I was gonna say something to do with the walkie talkies, but if she's already going in there, sweet, sure, yeah. Should be pretty easy. I mean, all I need to do is drop something in here and she'll pick it up. Look at this celery, don't you want this? I think this is celery. What is this actually? This isn't celery. It's a leak. There you go. You can get it. How do you not see it? It's right there. I'm very confused. Look at all the other stuff that's over there, too. Too easy. Wait! She's not trapped? Okay, she is trapped. Good. Excellent. <laughs> oh, I see what I'm supposed to do with these. So they remember me. When are they gonna call it animal control? They like me. I'm mischievous. I still have one left. Make someone buy back their own stuff. I get the concept. I just don't know how to show him that his plane is here. Oh wait, I just, I have an idea. Hey. No, 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 don't be scared. Don't be scared, don't be scared. We'll play soccer together. Look. Look at this ball. Follow me. Come on. I don't know how to get him. All right, we'll have to do this the hard way. Go to the store. Yep, there you go. What is Ankara messy? I know messy, what does Ankara mean?
How do I draw? <laughs> oh well. I think we're good. This thing could be useful, man. I I can like jump on it. We might come back for that. Do you want chat to tell you secret tasks? If I'm just gonna completely miss it, then yeah, you can tell me. Cause I'm not gonna go back. No, oh, this is kind of nice. You aren't playing this all week? What do you mean? I don't think it'll take me all week to finish it now. That's what you're implying. Yeah, you have to tell me in a riddle. All these roads are stuck. I feel like I just wasted that. Oh, here we go. Hey, what's this? A bow. Oh, it's you again. What's up, dude? Should I go upstream, you think? I don't want to follow it. What do you wish for? Uh, I didn't have anything in mind. I guess I just wasted it. Why is the put in basket not crossed out? I'm not sure. I was kind of wondering that too, but I'm just treating it like I completed it already. I'm taking this. It's a chocolate coin that floats. <laughs> I'm surprised they can't go in there. This is not what I expected. This almost feels like an open world game. How do I mess this up to flood the whole town? <laughs> Amphibious superiority. No. They subject a dark herd peck. I like that name. That's a good name. Thanks for the sub, dude. Ever thought about making music again? I made like a really crappy music beat that some people from chat have been working on to try and like flesh it out. I had like some weird beat in my head and I was like, I feel like writing this down because I'm bored, but I can't write it down. So I type, I Googled online sequencer, like music sequencer or something, I picked the first thing. It won't let you mix. It won't let you do a whole lot of things. The only drum set is basically like the crappiest 808 drum set you ever heard or like a rock band drum set. But you know what, we made it work. We did it. Well, kind of did it. I thought it would be fun to see like chats interpretations of it too. So we'll see. 
Hey, I want to come in. Someone let me in, dude. Let me in! Oh, baby. What do I gotta do? Make someone break the fancy vase. I mean, I could do that myself, but help the woman dress up the bust? Make the man spit out his tea. That'll probably be easy. Get dressed up with a ribbon. Make the man go barefoot. Do the washing. With a bra, a pair of socks, a slipper, a bar of soap. Okay. So I gotta find some... Oh, wait. How do you not spit, dude? We'll hide. Is the UK the only place that drinks tea? Like all the time. Did that count as spitting out his tea? Shit. Tea is banned outside England. I don't think Americans drink much tea. Like Canadians don't either, right? Turkey drinks more, Japan, basically everywhere. I don't like green tea. Other tea's okay. He's scared, dude. Yeah, I like sweet tea. Why would a goose purposely harass a old man? Because I'm controlling the goose. <laughs> this is just par for the course for me. Come on, spit it out. Is he not gulping? Is that the problem? What else do I have to do to him? Get dressed up with a ribbon? Oh, I found the ribbon. I'll explore a little bit. I just feel like it. I'm surprised they can't open this at all. Play Metal Gear music. I could do that if you guys want me to. Oh, that would make him spit out his tea. Holy shit. Oh, wait. Wait, how do I reset it? Oh, maybe she does the resetting. <laughs> you soft locked it. Who has a big ass bell in their backyard? I think it's because she's an artist. Artists do weird shit. How do I put this on? I know how to do it. I know how to do it. I know how to do it. I need to get rid of this duck. Fuck. Hide the body. <laughs> no! Ha <laughs> ha 
No, don't take him away. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, get the base. Get the base. Get the base. Get the base. Look at me. Dress me up all pretty. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got some drip. Make the man go barefoot. Make the man spit out his tea, help the woman dress up the bust. What is it, this thing? Help her dress it up? Hmm. She's spying. What the fuck, why are you doing that? Finally. <laughs> okay, so they're arguing with each other, which I don't blame them. How do I get the vase to be destroyed? Make someone break the fancy vase. I need to put it on something. Oh, what's over here? I can't go this way. Don't take her bong. It's tough, I can't really mess up the painting. Oh wait, yeah I can. Wait, can I? I might be able to. <laughs> Yet he keeps coming back. Truly not the smartest man. Nah, it won't really let me do anything with the painting. I'll take this away. How do I go back? Oh shit. Yeah, we got a bra. Run! Where would I wash stuff? I see the soap. No! I'm like stuck in this area. I need to figure out how to get out. Like, it looks like I can go there, but I don't know how. I remember the big fountain I saw earlier, but I'm not sure how to get back. That's the issue. Oh, there we go. Okay, now we're, now we're doing it. I'll start with the soap, because we're gonna need this anyways. Let's see, here maybe? I don't think I can lift it up there, so it probably won't work. But down there, yes. Okay, that's the plan, let's do it. Hey, don't take my ribbon. I worked hard for this ribbon. 
He better not take that soap either. <laughs> oh! My ribbon! I lost my drip. This is one of my favorite games. It can be pretty tricky. So if you have a hard time understanding some of the puzzles or some of the complex patterns, you can watch a YouTube guide. It was useful for me. Nah. I like screwing around. It's more enjoyable for me. This guy's ruining everything. He's taking my soap. He took my bra. He must be destroyed. Still not sure what to do with the vase. Like, how do I get people to destroy the vase? Maybe I bring the vase to this guy, and then when he puts it... I have an idea. He puts... Dude, get it, get it. Excellent. Brute force. <laughs> okay, take the vase, give it back to her. No, I can't be in the corner. Oh, he broke it anyways. All right, excellent. Hey, where'd the soap go? He just goes back to drink his tea. <laughs> Seriously, though. Why would he throw it? He put it on, like, the side of the fence, I think. And fucked up. Chat, where'd he put the soap? He screwed me. I can't find it. She put it back? Well, not really. At least we found it, though. All right, what else? We need a slipper. How do I take your shoes, dude? You would think, like, when he walked in the water, he made his slippers wet, and he would have to take them off, but it doesn't really seem like that played a part at all. Can you please tell your idiot chat to stop making copy pastas? No, it's impossible. The more you complain about it, the worse it's gonna get. Can't be helped. Damn. The, so like for this, make the man go barefoot. I would think he goes in the water, he comes out, he's like, damn, my slippers are wet. And then he takes them off, but he already walked in the water and then he walked out and then he didn't take his slippers off. Also, I don't really want him to go back in the water because he's gonna notice all my shit and put it back. It's kind of tough. Just grab them off his feet. I have an idea. I think you guys are correct. But he needs his newspaper back. Alright, it's a truce. Would you like the morning paper, sir? <laughs> Take it back. Now I lie and await as my master plan develops. Come on, look at your paper. Look at your paper. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby.
We'll just look right here. Seriously? He goes with one slipper? I can't take the other one? Huh. Maybe now I get him in the water. Oh, I got your pipe. I get your pipe. Nope, you gotta go in the water, dude. <laughs> yes. Fuck, though. Did he step with his non slipper foot? Help the woman dress up her bust. Maybe I dress it up with his old man hat. Oh, my hat. He's bald, so he would naturally want to put the hat on the bust, right? Yeah, look, it works. It's perfect. Oh my god! Hey, wait a sec. How come that wasn't a success? You need more? This looks goofy. Like, putting this stuff on the bus looks weird anyways. I like how she doesn't give stuff back. She just puts it on her statue. <laughs> now I wait. Clint, this isn't a spoiler, but if you beat the checklist in under six minutes, you get a special reward. What kind of special reward? So that's not enough either. I still need more. I guess the pipe? Goose cock? Okay, I'm going to pass on that. This doesn't seem as much of a puzzle as it is just kind of like, you know, you bring some stuff from side A to side B and then, because it's like all the answers seem to be just taking the free stuff from one side and bringing it to the other. Please work. Make the man go barefoot. Now this, I don't really know. Make someone prune the prize vase? I don't know what that means, chat. What does pruning a vase mean? Isn't like pruning flowers, like pulling leaves and stuff off? Oh, rose. <laughs> That makes much more sense, okay. So I guess the way that this works is like, you have to do everything on the checklist except like one thing, and then you get like the super checklist item that you have to complete. Make someone prune. So this is the super rose. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. 
Eat the tree, dude. We don't have much time. Just keep eating it. Wow. Am I doing this wrong? What the fuck? Are you going to chop my head off or something? <laughs> okay. I still don't know how to make him go barefoot. No, 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 you, I meant to take your shoes. My bitch. I wonder if I show him this if he'll cry. <laughs> I'm sorry. You bitch. He takes both slippers off when he takes a dump. I think, I know this is a Seinfeld bit, but I actually do think it feels good when I take a dump to just get completely naked. You know the origin for um, the Pepe the Frog is from a comic book where a guy finds Pepe peeing in the bath, or peeing in the uh, toilet, and he puts his pants down to his ankles. And they're like, Pepe, why do you put your pants down to your ankles? And he's like, feels good, man. Okay, chat, can I move on without getting his slippers both off? Because I seriously don't understand how to do it. I'm putting it on this side. The solution is always just put shit on the other side. What in the world? Why does everyone hate me so much? I'm an angel. Maybe I can take that one off when he's drinking tea or something and I just haven't tried it. Would this game be considered a Souls-like? It's a roguelike. It's a roguelike Soulsborne game. Are you looking at me? We're friends. As my one act of vengeance, my one final act, I'm taking this with me. Whoa, what's going on? This is your package now. And this is your mail. <laughs> You're welcome. I wonder why you'd need to re- well, maybe there- maybe you do have to reset for some reason. It'd be kind of weird. Are we hyped for Death Training 2? Not at all, but I'll probably play it. I don't give a shit about the story. 
Kojima stories sometimes. Well, okay, I don't know all Kojima stories, but Death Stranding was basically like you are the guy, which feels like every single fucking story that ever exists for any video game. And on top of that, it was just like there were moments where it's just like they puke exposition at you for like an hour and a half. It's just like, I have no idea what's happening. I have no idea what's happening. Blah! And then they just give you like, they tell every, like an hour long cutscene. It's just way too much. It's ridiculous. Oh, this is the shortcut area. I don't know why I need to come back here, but cool. Super Trip Land Game? I've never heard of it. Unless you mean... Unless that's not its actual name and you're just, like, describing it, which may be. Oh! Why would I need this? Get into the pub. Break the dartboard. I think I need to get someone to notice the box first before I do this. She's looking at his, oh never, wait. Oh, she's looking at me. I thought she was looking at his dick. Why is she doing that? Oh, hey, no, 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 you can't. I need to get in that box. You're not allowed to do that yet. Maybe she puts the box in and then I can get in it later. Oh, I see what she's doing. Okay, that's fine. That's no big deal. I think what I might try and do is like quack a few times and then get in the box. That might be the play. He's just gonna kick me out, I think. He's the bouncer. Get in, get in, what's wrong with you? Why is this so hard? No, no, I did it. It worked before, I don't understand. I've never heard of it, Fraxtal. I'll check it out. Is it on Steam? Oh, you're a tough guy, huh? Oh, he won't even flap his wings at me because he's a bitch. He's a beta duck. Or goose. I keep forgetting that. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> All right, now we wait. Wait. Okay, now we wait. Oh, he's shilling NFT crypto games? Oh. Never mind then. I don't want to play an NFT game. Fuck that shit. I have this really fun game. It's called Diarrhea Coin. It's not really a game. You just kind of spend money and get a coin, but still, I've enjoyed it. Huh. So she took the other box and she forgot about me. She needs to come back. Where'd the lady go? Oh, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming. <laughs> This isn't suspicious at all. Act natural. Book it. Where am I? <laughs> oh, I'm under the floorboards. I'm supposed to be here.
What am I supposed to do in here? Break the dartboard. Get the toy boat. Make the old man fall on his bum. Be awarded a flower. Steal a pint of glass and drop it in the canal. Set the table. You know, I read all that. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, let's just focus on breaking the dartboard first. This guy looks like he's having fun. Time to ruin his day. Oh shit. How can I break the dartboard? He'd have to do it. Unless, maybe? I'm trying to place the stool, but it doesn't look like I can walk on top of it. I'll come back to this. I'm, I don't know exactly how to do that. We'll think about it. Okay, so they're chilling. Get the toy boat, I haven't seen that. Make the old man fall on his bum. The old guy's probably the guy that's playing darts. Be awarded a flower. Maybe they'll give me the flower if I do something cool. I wonder what would be cool. Maybe I play this song for them, and then they think I'm awesome. Hey, look. Ah, oh, shit. I'd like to stand here and do something. Look at these. Hmm. Yeah, I think that is what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I know how to make him fall on his bum. Oh, shit. Honk for them? They're not going to be impressed with just mere honking. But I'll try it. See, that's only, like, kind of impressive. But this, this is like blowing your tits off craziness. <laughs> I knew it. You can have this back. I'm waiting for him to sit on his chair again. Oh, I feel bad. So what I need to do here, steal a pint and drop it in the canal, easy. Wait, where's the canal? I think I might be going backwards. Okay, I went backwards, <laughs> fuck. Old people falling is like the number one cause of death. Yeah. I don't know. I just, I didn't think about it too hard. It was on my checklist, dude. What am I supposed to do?
Hey. Ah. Oh. Fuck. Let me find what they mean. Okay, so I gotta drop it here. All right, got it. I can do that. It's because they break their hips, which is bad. Chat, you don't want to break your hip ever, but especially when you're old, it's bad news. What the hell's a fan cam video? I'm pretty sure it's like a porn cam show thing. I don't know. Sounds like it, doesn't it? You don't have to open the box to honk. Oh yeah, you're right. What have you been watching? Nothing. I probably, I, dude. I feel like I have been watching something, and I'm just lying to you. What the fuck, dude? I definitely just watched something like a couple days ago that I liked, and I was gonna say something about it, and I forget. No, I haven't seen Last of Us. That's not it. I might have seen a movie. Yeah, I definitely watched something and I forgot. <laughs> it must not, not have been that good, I guess. No, I haven't seen Puss in Boots, which I wasn't going to see, but you guys... I want to see where she places me, because maybe she brings something back out. Which... Then I could escape with my mug back. How does another box end up out there though? Like does she just place it, do something, and then like bring it back? She's she's got the most pointless job ever. Yeah, and I'm a streamer. I know pointless jobs when I see them. What is this? What it what is this thing? Is this a, it looks like a garbage that you like step on the bottom and like a thing opens up. Is this like a car thing? It's a hat. Set the table. Oh yeah. It won't let me move this though. I assume this is the table I'm setting. Yeah, it is. Pepper, candle, knife, fork. Okay. Probably gonna have to steal a bunch of that. No. You didn't see anything. I wanna see if she takes me back outside. Oh my God. Gotta be real sneaky, like. Well, I do need a candle. Wait, what did I just pick up? What is, what, what is this? Oh, I had the cork in my mouth. Oh, come on. Okay, good. That was some Metal Gear Solid shit right there. I 
I want it to stand up. Perfect. So that's how we make the distraction consistently. I see a fork. Ooh, well, everything's all right next to each other. No, I don't want the plate. Probably should have grabbed the knife because the fork's in an easier to get location, but whatever, it doesn't really matter that much. What else do I need to do? Oh yeah, I need to get the dartboard still. Where the fuck is the toy boat? I need this. <laughs> toy boat, toy boat, toy boat. Is it supposed to be hard to say? Maybe a mere mortal would have problems with it, but I'm a streamer, dude. I'm used to tongue twisters. Oh, there it is. Toy boat, toy boy, toy boat. <laughs> that is kind of hard to say. Hey, I need this. I need this shit. No, it was so close. You got bigger problems than me. <laughs> How do I get that thing? Come on, boat. She's trapped me. I'm buying time. I got it. Now I don't want to have it, but whatever. <laughs> Good enough. I got a knife. Get away. Oh, she took my shit. How did she disarm me like that? Oh, she just made me drop it. Nice. Break the dart board. Still have no idea to do that. Let's see what it, let's see how he plays with his darts. Why is everyone looking at me, man? Hmm. Maybe it's like when he goes to take the dart off the board, if I scare him, he'll like fall into it or something. That's the, I'm gonna try that. Did I never change the title for this game, by the way? Because I totally forgot. Nah, he doesn't care. 
Okay, good. Hmm. Break the dartboard. He doesn't even have a dart in his hand. What is he doing? Maybe I have to bring something over here to stand on? Or something... Something else, man. What the... Doesn't look like there's a ton of other things I can use to like manipulate stuff in this room though. There's rings. He doesn't like when I fuck with the stool. I mean, maybe I can do the same thing where I bring the stool over here and there is a way for me to stand on it. That might be possible. Oh, he doesn't get distracted though. Permission to swag out? Yeah, you can swag out. I'm getting kind of ready for sleep time, guys. Just throwing it out there. Well, not even sleep time. We're like... We're like waffles and donut time. Hey, what's your guys' favorite kind of donut? Because I showed a picture on my Snapchat that was um, a pink frosted... A pink sprinkled frosted donut or whatever, which is like the Homer Simpson donut. That's the best kind of donut there is. It's so good. Apple fritters are pretty good too. I used to order, um... fuck, what are those things? I, I don't know what donut place I would order from. Probably Dunkin' Donut. No, it wasn't Dunkin' Donuts. It was, I don't know, it was like something weird. And you could order a random donut. And the first time they gave me a random donut, it looked like they gave me, they just put a giant turd in the box and just gave it to me. And it was like extra expensive. It was huge. But I think it was an apple fritter and it was really good. I don't like it when they have apple chunks in it though. Don't give me that shit. That's too healthy. It's fucking icky. Yeah, I ate it. I feel like this has purpose. Like I can activate it or something, but I don't know how to activate it. Maybe this is how I break. Nah, I don't know. I feel like something would have happened. I'm trying to focus on breaking the dartboard, but I don't know how to do it. Probably something simple, and I'm overthinking it. See, it's like, I don't understand how to get him to manipulate it in any way. I'll do the cup thing. <laughs> oh. I didn't mean to do that. My bad. Nah, churros are pretty good. Whenever I go to baseball games, I get churros and dipping Dots. <laughs> I 
I tried to make churros in the oven before. They didn't work. Also, I think they may have made me sick. <laughs> hey, it was it was an attempt, all right. I want to place this and not break it. You think I can drop it from like one inch off the floor? Okay, good. My local mall has Dippin' Dots vending machines and it's super overpriced. Dippin' Dots made it seem like in the future everything would be in dot form. Like dots were the superior shape. <laughs> but nothing's in dot form. I'm living in the future. Aren't Dippin' Dots always super overpriced? Yeah, but everything in a baseball game is super overpriced. If you just get like a water bottle, it's like $9. I haven't even gone to a baseball game in forever. It's probably worse than I remember. Dippin' Dots requires, like, nitrogen cooling, so it's expensive. Whoa. What is this guy doing? Stop it. Alright. Now you gone and done it, dude. Now you gone and done it. No! Oh, what a little bitch. I was trying to get his shoelaces. Speed run. Damn it. I can do it again. God damn it. How did I do it that one time? Oh, I'm pissed, dude. I am pissed. Get in there. What are you... Why is this so difficult? There we go. Death Stranding's a good video game. Give me more ways to waste my points. Um, you don't want to waste your points. You want to save them and then brag about how many points you have. I think the points are really funny. It's like... It's like the equivalent of, like, regular dollars, except there's no purpose. There's nothing you can do. It'd be, like, nothing you can buy with your dollar. The only thing that you can ever do is just continue to gamble. Not on a honk. I'm stealth. Clint saying he used to go to baseball games. Got to be the most white. Oh, yeah. Just crazy. No one who's ever... No person who's ever a different uh, skin color has ever gone to a baseball game. <laughs> If you want me to blow your mind, I've gone to football games and basketball games. I've never been to a hockey game, though. I'm running out of cups. I'm gonna, like, have to reset. I think I may have actually run out of cups. What the fuck? I don't want to reset the whole thing. Dude, 
She's got no cups. We gotta break the dartboard, I guess. I've been on a golf course. Oh, wait, no, I have one still. Fuck, what am I doing? Hey, don't do that yet. Don't do that yet. Don't do that yet. Oh, you idiot. <laughs> no remorse. Yeah, I've played mini golf before. I played laser tag. I've oh, I can get another one there. I've done airsoft, paintball. I've played flag football in people's backyards. I'm really, I don't know how to ice skate, but I have, oh, shit. In like sixth grade, I didn't know how to rollerblade either, but they like made everyone rollerblade and I had just moved in sixth grade to a new school. And this new school is like doing this weird roller rink shit. And they had done the roller rink shit for like the last five years in a row. So everyone else is a beast and I'm sitting there like, And then falling. Would you ever go deep cave diving? No. I saw a horror movie about it, which wasn't really very good. Called like... I don't know, remember what it was called. We watched it as a chat. It was like the only movie we watched as a chat. Yeah, the descent. I I think. I'm not sure. Hmm. I have an idea. I have an idea. Wait. Not yet. That wasn't even what I meant to do. <laughs> hey, don't take my mug. I was saving that. Remember the first time I called, one of the first times I called Elon Musk stupid with the cave diving shit where he wanted to put the kids basically in a giant coffin to take them out? It's like, dude, this is such a terrible idea. Don't put the kids in coffins. What? Okay, come on. Come on. That was like the perfect scenario to do that and it didn't work. Where did she go? Huh. Weird. She disappeared. Oh, I thought it said Burly Mom. <laughs> 
burly man. Why she's called mom? I don't know. I don't question those things. I just figured it was her. I'm not really sure where to go. A lot of the time you complete the tasks and then it's like a new area opens up. I'm sure there is a new area that opened up. I'm just, I don't know. So that's the burly man. He doesn't really look that burly. Would you get hair implants if you had hair issues? Um, yeah, maybe, I don't know. I don't think I look very good bald. How come people don't wear wigs more? I could get a sweet like mullet wig. No, I don't like hats. They're itchy? Oh, that sounds awful. They actually are. They do, you just don't know it. Also a good point. Oh, I remember being over here. Let's go this way. Yeah, if I'm bald, I gotta be ripped. I'd definitely be going pumping steroids. Also, when I came from here, so I'm just backtracking. Hey, do steroids help beard growth? Or is that like something separate? No. Okay, I remember this area. Man, it's gotta be in the back of the bar. I'm gonna go back over there. There's no way it's over here. This is where I came from. I'm, I'm going back in the box. And I'm moving the sign, cause fuck these guys. You just get more hair where you don't want it. I see. I just want to distract it so I can get into box. <laughs> uh oh. Run, distraction work. No, oh, I was so close. Oh, 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 shit. <laughs> I've never seen her out here before. This is kind of weird. Do you think this is a good endpoint? I'm st I want to figure out where to go first. Wait, I just figured it out, I think. If she stops being annoying. All right, all I need to do is fly like two feet. Come on, we can do it. I thought geese could fly. What the fuck is this? You're almost at the end. Yeah, I don't want to waste it. Maybe I can push this a little bit. No. <laughs> yeah, that guy definitely is a bot. 
Anyone use chat GPT at work? I used it a lot yesterday and I made my... Wait, no, his account was made in 2011. I'm confused. He's been sub for two months. I, re I don't know. I'm confused. I'm not a bite. I'm not a bot. I write original copy pasta on my account. It's 10 years old. I'm so confused. They're all around us. <laughs> hmm, it's tough to really I mean his account is 10 years old. That's pretty nuts. That's like a, such an old account. What the fuck? Yeah, you you made an account. It was just in TV. That's so fucked Do I have to drop the bucket on his head? to go to the next area or is that just like a optional thing because i'm really not sure how to drop the bucket on his head unless that's the burly man the guy lifting boxes and stuff Oh, maybe I can do, go in here? Huh. Can I go in here? No. You ain't catch me, dude. Oh, they put the bucket back up? What the fuck, dude? Hi, it's me, your only viewer. For months I've created the illusion that you are streaming to a large audience, but here's the truth. All these people in the chat are me. Damn. So this bucket, you think if I like untie his shoelaces and then he runs after me and then he falls on the ground, I can just like drag this bucket to his head or something. No. Well then what the hell is the point of this bucket? Just take the bucket bag. I don't know what to do with it. All right, Chad, I'm stumped. I don't know how to leave. Can someone give me a, a riddle or a hint or something? What's under the bucket? It's like a little ring of water. Have you tried leaving? Yeah, and I don't know where to go. I'm lost. I have an idea. What if... I put something on this that la that's in between... Oh shit, dude. You're overthinking it? Yeah, I know. I normally do. <laughs> I don't know how to leave. Maybe I go in the box again and she puts me in a different spot this time? I 
I'm thinking maybe I do have to do the final. Like, maybe there is no escape, and I just... <laughs> I have to hit someone with this bucket. In which case, the only way I'm going to be able to do that is sitting here and waiting for someone to do it. All right, burly man. Please, no. Please, no. We're okay. We can do this. No. Oh my God, what is he doing to me? All right, we're gonna try this again. God damn it, he fixed the bucket when I wasn't there. I'm gonna bait him. Are you fucking kidding me? I can win this if you just weren't here! Stop! How come, oh my god, if I just waited a second longer? Put the bucket back up, you idiot. God damn it. Yes, fix the tomatoes. Finally. Ah. Oh. Okay, so now he opens the path for me. I'm gaming. It wasn't my fault. <laughs> ah, shit. Are you gonna at least wipe your ass? He's like... Why did you not take the glass? I don't know, I just didn't want to. I can't believe he goes back to do it again. I assume this is where I leave. And he's just blocking me over and over again like a dick.
That was the solution. Nice. I knew I was missing something. Okay, so I guess you do have to do those. That was a challenge? Steal a beautiful miniature golden bell? Is this a golden bell? Is that a flower? No. I want it. What is this going to kill me? This seems kind of unsafe. I'm trying. It's mine. Take it all the way back home. Okay, easy. Where is home? <laughs> it's a children's game of course they smash the goose under its head this is not a children's game oh i can't open it seriously shit Maybe somewhere else in the... No, not there. Hey, thanks for the sub in pieces. I appreciate it. Down here, maybe? No. Hmm. You should speedrun this? I'm good. I like how every single variety game I play, there's always someone that's like, you should speedrun this. Like, I was playing Super Psycho Baseball and fucking hating life, and they were like, you should speedrun this. Nah, I'm good. I guess I gotta go back here. Don't worry. Why the fuck do you guys want my bell? Get away from me. This is mine. Nobody's taking it. Because I'm loud? So? <laughs> they should learn to get over it. Oh my god, who locked all the gates? Hello, lady. Sorry about that. Please don't take my bell. Stop it! There is li I have no choice here, lady. What? I just re reverse wrong warp through the gate. Give me my bell. Oh, you. 
You think that's gonna stop me? Oh, she's kind of smart. No. I, I got all the bells. I like how she's like, what is that noise? Are you kidding me? How am I gonna leave then? Hmm. He wants his revenge! What did the game end? I have to choose between right and down. One is bad end, one is good end. Oh, my controller died. That's why I'm so confused. <laughs> I thought that was a part of the game. One sec, it's gotta reconnect. Dude, it won't reconnect. There's something weird going on, on my computer. It's like sometimes it's like the U some of the USB ports just like unplug and then replug really fast. I don't get it. It wasn't happening until I moved. So maybe like something got loose. Why do you all take my bell? I'm just doing this because I'm mad. <laughs> Building up speed. <gasps> She's still standing there. Where's that kid? That kid's gonna shit his pants when he sees me running by. Are you kidding me? Yeah, that's right. Get the fuck out of here, kid. Can't handle this. No, I'm so close. The old man. Who's still locked out. How did you get back in? <gasps> Look at him. Friendship. Friend. Friend. <laughs> Friend. Just kidding. Go, 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 go. Is this where I started? Oh, I remember there was that big area with a bunch of bells in the back. I'm bringing this back to my bell storage. My secret lair. I wonder, I must have missed so many of the secret things though. 
because there was like a page with like eight secret things. Easy game. That was kind of fun. Like a fun little side game. I thought it was going to be longer. Actually. You guys said it was going to take me like four hours. You must think I'm an idiot. <laughs> This is a good place to stop. Yeah. Okay. I don't think there's any like after credit shit. So that's it for me. I'm gonna get breakfast. Thanks for watching. I think in the future, I'm probably gonna stream at a more normal schedule. I know that I wanna play Dota with the boys at some point. I don't know if I'll stream that, but they don't stay up as long as I do. So other than Lakari, I think Lakari does. But like Atrioc, definitely don't. Mango will, but probably not happily. And then Connor, I'm not really sure what his schedule is. The problem... I, I love Bulldog. Even though I've never met him before. I'm a fan. But I also don't want to just get hard carried by someone who's like a god at the game. You know, like, you play multiplayer games, and you kind of want at least to be able to feel like you're pulling your own weight, right? Whereas Lakari, I'm pretty sure he's bad if he's not on a Wind Ranger. <laughs> so we just make him not play mid, and he'll be, like, on our level anyways. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. I'm heading out. Is it just, is it, is it, I guess it's just the same game. Okay. See you dudes. Uh, don't be surprised if I'm middle of the day, but I'll probably say something if I am middle of the day, so. Later.